Oh, hello guys. If it ain't one thing, it's ten dozen others. Uh, run out of beans. I've got two more, you know, one round, down and back. I'm out of beans. And I'm sitting here getting something to drink. That lovely hose down there for the loader let loose. And there's a nice puddle down there now. So, I'm going to have to start this thing up, put it in road gear, and try to get to the barn before I run out of hydraulic oil. Should be fun. So, the replant is done now. <laughs> uh, don't laugh at my crooked rows. Uh, the markers were not working at that point. And I was going by eyeball. So don't laugh too much. We've all done worse. Uh, I'll tack this on to another video. We'll see you in a bit, guys. Isn't that lovely? Right out of the hose. They got a nice pedal on the ground. So if I didn't have, if I wasn't close enough to being done, I'm done now. Uh, uh, this is, mm. <laughs> uh, the disc openers worked great on this uh, planter, the ones I changed. Uh, the two outside rows were always, and I mean always, a pain in the butt because they always plugged up. Uh, I guess it's partially because of the blades being wore and bad bearings. But uh, even this one, yeah did a good job um, had to readjust the depth a little bit but it all worked so barring any other major malfunctions uh, <laughs> I'm done planting I hope because uh, these are up they look pretty decent uh, Yes, that is the rose I was filming down through there that got a little wonky. So please forgive my crooked rose. Ah, what the heck. You get more in a crooked row anyway, so, you know. But at any rate, guys, uh, the no-tails with the drill are coming through slowly. Uh, me and the drill are parting ways. Uh... I've tried it four years and it just it's just not there the drill is just not what this ground needs it just won't work in this ground uh, any other ground it probably do fine uh, it's very disheartening to say the least I just had to replant I don't know, 14 acres because of the drill. Uh, not because it was putting them in too deep. It was because it packed the ground around the seed uh, to where it couldn't come through. It just packed tight. So it's going to go down the road. Uh, you can see the green rows here of the no-till. They work. It works. The old AC planter works in this ground because it doesn't push down on the ground around the seed. 
it leaves it open, leaves it loose, and it comes up. Uh, the drill just, it, no. It packs the ground so hard, it's unreal. And in this ground, you, ca you can't crust the ground over on top of the seed because the seed ain't going to grow. It'll rot in the ground. But at any rate, guys, uh, I'm officially done now with this place. Uh, looks like I got another hydraulic hose to fix. <laughs> uh, on top of everything else I need to do. Uh, I'm really amazed they were calling for showers and thunderstorms this evening. And... So far, so good. We haven't got them, but I'm hoping we do, because that'll sure set what I plant, just planted. Uh, should be good to go. Um, we'll have to wait and see. Uh, <laughs> but the sun is setting. You see it through there. Uh, the AC planter. We're done with for another year. Here, I should say, I'm done here with it for another year. Uh, I'm gonna get new, uh, put all those new colors on this, buy some cylinders, put the hydraulic markers back on it, uh, and do a few other things. And she'll be right as rain come next year ready to rock and roll but at any rate guys Oliver's been doing everything duty and now she's let me know she needs a rest I guess huh loader's been on here a long time and I've never had to do anything to it so it can it can let loose with the hose. Yeah, that hose is bad even up there. It's leaking summers. Hey, anyway, right, guys. Me and the old Ollie say we'll see you next time. And as always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. We'll see you next time, guys.